Hello everyone. In this particular lecture, we are going to learn about how to integrate Tailwind CSS in your React app. Well, Tailwind CSS is a CSS framework that is used to create modern and the responsive designs quickly. So instead of writing the custom CSS, you can use the predefined utilities and the classes directly in your HTML and your JSX file. Right? So let's go to our Visual Studio code and understand that how we can integrate the Tailwind CSS. Let's start. So this is your Visual Studio code and your React app. Inside the app.jsx component, you can see uh, some code is uh, already written here after installing and this is creating this kind of web page. Right? Here you can see the logo and some hooks are used due to which uh, this is this button is working right so something is available on this website so uh, let's see that how the CSS part of it is working well it is importing a CSS file which is app.css right as you can see here this is the custom CSS file uh, by which everything is being done here but I want to integrate Tailwind CSS so for that uh, first I will do what uh, I will remove all these things because there is no need of that right now just put a div here and remove everything which is available here let's delete this app.css file also and there is no use of it and main index.css has also no use but let's keep it here because it is connected with our main.jsx file right so just clean it up just just clean it up right yeah it is clean now inside the main.jsx file everything is fine just uh, you need to see that it is importing index.css just comment it down right okay now now let's go to our documentation of tailwind css as you can see i have removed everything from there so it is blank now uh, let's go to our tailwind css inside this i will go on the first website that is tailwind and as on the top you can see i am having a docs right so just click on it now you can see we using white since we are going to work with the white right so uh, we are going to learn that how we can integrate in the white uh, for that uh, first step here everything is like given in the documentation you just need to just implement that uh, first say is saying that you need to put this code inside your terminal so for getting the terminal you need to click on control plus black back tick uh, then this particular page will get open uh, since the react app is working here and we want to install a package uh, we will go on this plus button just click on it and a new shell will get opened just simply paste the code here that is npm install tailwind css at the rate tailwind css slash white just click on the enter button and your package is now start downloading it might take some time so for that uh, i'm just pausing my video So yeah, as you can see here, the package is now installed. Uh, eight package are looking for funding. Okay, that's not needed. And there are some random warnings. You need to just ignore that, right? Now after doing this, you can see here, it is saying that import Tailwind CSS from this this particular line of code should should be available inside your white tailwind dot config dot ts. Well, we are having the white config dot js. So simply go on it. Right, uh, just go on the white.config.js and inside of, of the top, right, just paste this line. Just paste this line. Import, import tailwind CSS from at the rate tailwind CSS slash white. Right now, uh, you can see here I'm having one more plugin that is tailwind CSS. Right, so for that, simply just go on inside this bracket of the plugins and put a comma here and write your tailwind css plugin now it is also getting attached with your configuration of white now simply import the tailwind css now uh, as you can see here i'm having this main.jsx file which is the main java um, uh, main file which your react app have right so here you can see import app we were having that import index.css 
right now if you go here and just paste this import right so import tailwind css so it will get connected with it now everything is done you just need to re, uh, start your application even if you have already started there is no problem in that fine so let's uh, go to our app.jsx file everything is blank here let's write hello there right hello now uh, you can see i'm having this hello here on the top fine now if i want to change the color of it simply just go on the div write class name inside of it you can write your classes of the tailwind css that is uh, text 5 excel if i go now and see you can see the font size is now increased to the 5 excel everything which you want that background like bg is should be red 200 now if i go and you can see i'm having the background as the red it means that whatever the command you give uh, or the classes you put of the tailwind css it will work fine after doing these simple easy steps fine so yeah uh, whatever the component you make in your whole react app if you have put the import tailwind css in your index.css file it will work fine so this was all for today's video i hope you understood very clearly that how we can integrate our tailwind css it is one of the most easiest and the most prominent method and uh, this is the starting of your react right so this was all for today's video thank you so much for watching goodbye